This is Channel 2 News, coverage you can count on. We're very excited to be able to open the medical rescue unit this Friday. It, it's a great thing for the city of Reno. Some fire stations in the Truckee Meadows will soon be back open for business. And that is our Channel 2 News Week story at 5 o'clock. Station 19, for example, in Somerset has been closed mm. for, what, about six yeah, years now? Quite some time. Yep, but soon that'll change. Good evening, I'm Kristen Remington. And I'm Landon Miller. Thank you for joining us tonight. After years of discussion and planning, the City of Reno and the Reno Firefighters Association has finally come to an agreement tonight. Angela Schilling was able to talk to the Division Fire Chief today, and she joins us live from Station 19 with more. So, Angela, when will they be back open? Yeah, well, the big day is going to be early Friday morning and Station 19 will then be open. They'll be partially open and they'll also be ready to take calls. They'll also have a two person medical response team. Firefighters in Reno are staying busy, sweeping and cleaning. There's a lot of work to be done before the big reveal. It's been six years since Station 19 in Somerset was fully open. Because of the economy, the station had to be shut down several years ago. But by the end of the week, Station 19 will be partially staffed and ready to respond to medical calls within the district. There's nobody there now. There'll be, there'll be two people there that will be staffed 24-7, 365, uh, starting this Friday. Their goal is to lower the response time to under six minutes. In the last three months, we've had approximately 88 calls in that district. Um, and there, there were some longer response times that we weren't really comfortable with. Especially in the Del Webb area. Del Webb is a senior community, and so their priority of having a medical response unit is something that I have certainly heard at numerous community meetings. Over the past few months, over half their calls to the Somerset area have been medical related. From the outside, their new unit looks just like an ambulance, except it's red. For now, the unit will be used to help stabilize the patient, but in the future, they hope to help transport patients to area hospitals as well. Each shift will have two intermediate level EMTs on board. It's a great time. It's, it's going to be great for everybody. Definitely a step in the right direction. And they also have plans to start a medical response team in the Collin Ranch area here soon. Covering the story live, Angela Schilling, Channel 2 News.